we know that where we are seeing increases, very concerning increases, are amongst the age group that you are describing. We also know that college campuses are places where people love to congregate, whether it's um, in the Greek system or it is in a, a dorm or it is um, in a bar, depending on the age of the students, of course. Um, and, and this makes it uniquely susceptible to COVID outbreak. So we're very concerned about it. And I was pleased to see that Dr. Stanley made that policy decision at, at Michigan State University. He is, um, you know, by profession an epidemiologist. So I know that, you know, the fact that our three, um, you know, largest universities, Wayne State, U of M, and, and MSU are led by people who are um, men of science, I, I think is gives me some comfort here. But I do think that it's important that we, this is an evolving conversation as this, our knowledge of this virus is, is always evolving as well. And so that is something that I think would be beneficial to um, their students, their uh, faculty, all of the workforce on our campuses. And so that is, I think, a, something that is, would be very helpful, and I'm encouraging them to do that.